Good morning, folks. Today we're going to be looking at pre-earthquake signals of two different varieties, more on the Russian mission to better monitor Earth's magnetic field, and a peek into the past 6,000 years ago. But we are starting, as always, with the last 24 hours on our star, and we find there were a few more M-class solar flares, but they were mostly confined to the incoming limb on the left, not erupting towards the Earth. There are several big sunspots just out of view about to turn in, and they will be the top eruption watch over the next week. Yesterday, a brief but impactful magnetic switch in the solar wind allowed plasma coupling and penetration, driving minor geomagnetic storm conditions overnight and into this morning. Not a major event, but it did light up the auroras a bit for those who are outside watching. The sunspots are complex, but these ones really haven't been firing. We'll be watching the incoming limb on the left for the appearance of those new ones. Should be later today. First up in the articles is a preprint about the millionth study saying atmospheric electricity is a key signal of a coming earthquake. While the list of similar studies piles up, we also have a new one out of Fairbanks. Scientists believe unusual small magnitude events can be used to gauge the risk of a bigger one, basically looking for patterns in foreshocks and comparing to normal seismicity and pre-event activity of past bigger quakes. We've got more here on the Russian mission to launch CubeSats to monitor Earth's magnetic field. They're going full throttle on this mission, set to launch in the coming months. They are ready to go and believe they can pull it off for a fraction of the price of Swarm and MMS. Last but not least, really interesting piece here on the incredibly advanced architectural knowledge of ancient civilizations. They say these buildings from a disaster cycle ago indicate they knew much more than we think. I know many observers already believe that. Here's more in that same vein. We greatly appreciate your support. We'll do this all again tomorrow. Right here, but right now at 6 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.